Hey Fools, Motley Fool contributor Steve Symington here and I'm going to talk about Berkshire Hathaway. Uh, specifically, one reason that I don't own shares of Berkshire in my own personal portfolio. Uh, now, keep in mind, I've written extensively about Berkshire Hathaway and Warren Buffett. Uh, I admire the companies and I actually believe that uh, the stock is going to continue to outperform the market. Uh, it may not outperform, uh, it, it definitely won't, even Warren Buffett uh, admits this, that it won't outperform quite as much as it has been was able to in the early years just sheerly because of Berkshire Hathaway's massive size uh, and as a result the big reason that I don't own Berkshire Hathaway um, is because I prefer a much smaller company instead Markel it's a it often referred to as a, a mini Berkshire because it follows uh, much the same uh, business model as Warren Buffett and Berkshire Hathaway does as a uh, financial holding company and uh, Markel, as it stands, comprises around 18% of my personal portfolio. I actually I added to that position uh, recently as well, and I told you when I did that. Um, but right now, shares of Markel, I believe, are undervalued. They sit around 1.2 times book value for the record. Berkshire shares sit around 1.37. Uh, and yes, they're fundamentally... Um, a little bit different uh, in the way they run and there may be a Buffett premium attached there um, but I think Markel stands to reward shareholders down the road as well uh, and in addition uh, it's worth noting that uh, even Tom Gaynor who stands at the helm of Markel's investment operations believes Berkshire Hathaway will outperform as well in fact as of the end of last quarter shares of Berkshire Hathaway comprised more than 12% of Markel's equities portfolio. That was uh, far and away the largest position that Tom Gaynor holds for Markel. So in a way, I'm actually uh, indirectly exposed to Berkshire Hathaway anyway, even though I don't own shares in my own portfolio. Um, I may purchase shares of Berkshire down the road, say perhaps if I want to have access to a uh, one of its annual shareholder meetings, which are quite the event for those of you who kept track. But for now, I am perfectly happy, happy owning shares of Markel. So there you have it. Fool on.